Vous nous avez montré tout à l'heure à quel point l'éducation pouvait être quelque chose de négatif dans la mesure où elle nous conditionnait et par là nous empêchait notre propre liberté. Et alors ce que j'aimerais vous demander c'est à vos yeux comment en quelque sorte pourrait se concevoir une éducation qui au contraire nous exercerait à la liberté, une éducation qui nous préparerait à une véritable expérience. Vous savez, je voudrais vous répondre en français, mais je, je ne veux pas massacrer le langue, alors je vais vous reprendre en anglais. So we are now, aren't we, educating people to conform to a pattern, become businessmen, scientists, uh, writers, and so on. Education is not bringing about good human beings, good in the sense holistic human beings, beings who are not fragmented, broken up, and therefore they lead a life of contradictions, conflict, misery, all that follows. So we are asking, what is right education, isn't it? Will education, that is, to teach people how to be good, can that, is that possible? Human beings need have knowledge, need to have knowledge. To be a good scientist, you must have knowledge. To be a good doctor, surgeon, you must have a great deal of experience, a great deal of study. So, as long as we are, we are trained to be professionals, I don't see any possibility of being really free, holistic. So, education as it is now is really, if I may point out, it's rather destructive. And it's a very, very complicated subject because there is on one side there are the parents who want all their children to be educated, to have good jobs, conform to a certain pattern culture, society, and also at the same time there are people asking that they must be free. The two are incompatible. So you have not only to educate the parents, you not only educate the educator and the student. It's a very complex process, education. And again, as we talked this morning, there are very few people who want to be really educated in the proper sense of that word. That means proper schools, proper university, right kind of study. It's, it's the cultivation of the mind, not cultivation of a particular subject. 